What's up, guys? And welcome back to Gran Turismo 7. We are back in the driver's seat, baby. And we have a new license. Your boy has been upgraded. Let's see what we've been up to. So uh, I did it off screen. I feel like the licenses just aren't really that fun to watch. Oh, wow. Our international B license. We've got some, some cool stuff in here. I want that R34. But yeah, we earned our A license. Now, these are all just first tries. I didn't, I get typically like in, in B here, I go through and I, I try to get gold for everything and do a couple of replays. These were just first tries because I wanted to get in this episode. I want to get into our next race. I feel like we did pretty good. We had a healthy amount of golds and silvers, a couple of bronzes in there. This one was fun. You're in like a, but uh, we, can, we can do this one. This one's just unique because you're in a tundra and you're off road. We haven't really seen a lot of off road racing in this game thus far. So, got to swing this guy wide. This, this hill was a little, a little bit tough. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, we, we could have done a little bit better there, but you guys, you guys get the gist. Then you come around this way. You just that that middle hill. You've got to get a nice slide to it. We got a, a bronze again there. So yeah, eventually I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna fix all those up, get all gold, so we can get the bonus car, and uh, we'll we'll make sure that we're, you know, all all iced out and nothing but gold. But um, for now, we are gonna move into our next main race which is gonna be one of the big like championship type things. Luca sent us the invite in the last episode. It's down here, the Trial Mountain Cups. This is a race series that takes place on Trial Mountain. Circuit surrounded by stunning scenery. We want a 600 PP US road car. We've got a couple of cars that would work here. Like obviously our Tesla, our Camaro, stuff like that. I'm kind of tempted to buy something new though. I've really been wanting to check out the Charger Hellcat. I feel like that'd be fun. Here it is, 2015 Dodge Charger Hellcat, 707 horsepower. My goodness, dude. In white, gray, black, red. I feel like red wouldn't look bad, but I feel like I feel like white is where it's at. That thing is is beautiful. All right, go ahead and purchase it. What was that like? 75k? I didn't even didn't even pay attention to it. 707 horsepower, baby. About to put these ponies to the ground. Dang, she looks good, man. Bit of a sleeper. You see chargers everywhere. They're not all Hellcats though. Here we go. Let's get it. We've got two laps and 11 people to pass. Or at least, uh, at least nine. We want to get, you know, top three or better. Please don't come in my line, baby. Here we go. That's a mountainous road. This is going to be kind of fun, man. I'm looking forward to this. Something a little bit different. We're not on a flat racetrack around the outside here. Don't want to just end up running into people, but at the same time, they're driving pretty slow back here, so let's try to get around them. Trev, let's hop inside. Let's see what we got. Nice and slow around this corner. Dude, this is beautiful. Look at the dude standing on the rock over there. Do you guys see him off to the left? That was an interesting spot to watch the race around this way all right we're up at a ninth place we got some work to do though a straight bomb through the tunnel man this would be insane what is this what is this awesome we got a left-hander coming up full send all the way gotta make sure we break in time we're good Woo. hello little love tap Kind of a dirty move, but hey, it's all right. We're up at a sixth place. Let's go. Okay. Whoa, whoa, what? We accelerate too hard out of that that turn or what? Woo. Okay. Yep. Just banging doors. That's what we do, Bumblebee. Let's go. This track is insane. This is my first time racing it. That's why I'm kind of all over the place here. I'm just trying to focus. I'm trying not to spin out or anything. This thing is crazy. I'm going to hop outside here. We try to keep pushing it. Ooh. Hard hairpin. Light acceleration out of it. Don't end up spinning those rear tires. Woo! Little dance with the wall, and here we go. All right, we're on to lap number two. This is my favorite track that we've had thus far. This is insane. So we want to... Uh, ideally, I mean, I, I want to get first. We're definitely going to have to push it here. Obviously, that... Woo! That straight segment is, is kind of where it's going to be at. The problem is you can't see what's coming next. 
Obviously here on lap two, I know it a little bit better, but a lot of these corners are either really, really sharp hairpins or you're like coming up over a hill and you just can't, you can't see a thing. I like it though. And I like that we're actually having to work. Let's go, baby. Give me mo Mopar power. Give me mo power. It's about drive, it's about power. It's like first and second are way up there. I don't know if we're gonna be able to be able to touch that, but as long as we cross the finish line in third, I think we should be in a decent spot. Feel like if we could have gotten around people a little bit quicker on time, we could have beaten these guys. I, th I think being stuck in traffic is the thing that slowed us down the most, but that's a part of the process, baby. Dude, we're so close, man. I just want them. I just want to yeet it into this corner and somehow find a way around, but it's just, it's just not going to happen. We'll take a third. I am mad at it. We got some work to do, though. If we want to we want to try to win this thing or technically I don't even think we have to win it I think you have to get top three so if we got third and we got to get top three we just got to get another top three here and we're guaranteed let's move on to our next race doing the same thing but reverse focus on third Trev focus on third you get third you're guaranteed to progress anything else is just a bonus here let's get it your boy's gonna have a bit more of a fire under him here I'm gonna be a little bit more willing to trade paint this segment is so cool with all the trees, dude. Come on, baby. Got a break and turn at the same time. Don't overdo it. A Little bit of sliding, but we're okay. This is the long straight. We're gonna end with a right, so we wanna stay over to the left. We're gonna have a right, left. Left and a hairpin. Come on, baby. Give me 708 if you got it, girl. Ooh, nice big group here gonna be able to get around quite a few of them try to break a little bit late Woo. I was hoping to be able to get him there get him on the hairpin here get that inside line there it is okay kind of a little easy action coming up here shouldn't even really have to break all that much Woo! sliding through them DMs girl okay let's not get let's not get too crazy here now we got our straight. All right. We've got a couple guys to pass. We're still not in the clear yet. Let's see what we can do. Oh, we, we got it though, on that long straight. Long as we don't go flying off the track, we're, we're definitely, we're getting at least second place here, if not first. I'd say we gun for first though. We're, we're, gonna, we're gonna do our best. Go through our favorite part of the track with all the trees and everything. That was clean. See if we can maybe get around this challenger in here. Don't, ah, I cut us off. Don't kill yourself to do so though, Trev. Keep it tight, keep it tight. Let's go, that was actually real. I mean, we, we kind of touched him a little bit, but that was pretty clean. You could argue that we had that line and, and he came down into us. We probably didn't, but uh, first place is way up there. We're not gonna be catching him, but it's a pretty good race. All right, nicely done. Long as we don't mess it up, just don't mess it up here Trev oh this is kind of intense not being able to see honestly you have a lot to lose and nothing to gain here Trev so let's let's just be smart coming out of the top dude oh it's like a flash of black there with your eyes readjusting Woo! Trev We're not gonna talk about it. I knew I had nothing to gain. Oh, pass him, pass him, pass him. Ah, oh, I was hoping we'd at least get fifth. We got six places. Is that gonna be enough points to be able to get top three? Please tell me. We lost, we missed it by a point. I've gotta replay both races now. Trav, you are such an idiot. Uh, all right, we are gonna head to the cafe. We played back through two of those races again. We got it. We got a third place. That was actually our, our first third. Uh, I feel like that one was a little bit more challenging. That the you know new car under leveled, the track was tough, and we're here on the wheels. So I like that we're actually starting to face a little bit of a uh, bit of a, a roadblock. I guess you could say. See the message from an American who watched the race. He wants to pay a visit to his new shop. It's called Legend Cars. 
I hear he's keeping it open for you. Why don't you head over there once you've picked up your reward? Sarah should be able to give you more details. Ooh, we got Fuji International Speedway, Autopolis, Legend Cars, Nissan Sports Cars, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Our next menu. Tell me there's a GTR in here. Yes, sir. R32 Fair Lady Z and a Sylvia Spec R Arrow. And obviously, this is kind of like the, the first iteration. There's no way they're not going to have us go after an R34 and an R35. So this should be... Uh, should be good. We're finally getting into the fun stuff, man. Like, we, it, it took a bit of grinding. I, I respect it. I've enjoyed it, but we're really starting to get into the, the cool cars now. Legend Cars is open. It's going to be over here on the East Coast. Thinking this is probably going to be some sort of like a classic cars, you know, icons, legends. Welcome to Legend Cars. It's a special dealership known only to a handful of collectors and accessible to even fewer. Legend Cars offers a limited number of highly sought after collectible cars from the 20th century, along with a few iconic cars that made their name on racetracks around the world. I want that Mira. I can't wait to see what they have to offer us today. Aston Martin DB5, James Bond. Hello, welcome to the Haggerty Collection. I'm Mikhail Haggerty and I'll be your advisor and guide to the collection. Here's the lineup of cars currently available. Go ahead, wander around, kick the tires, and it'll be your turn to take the wheel. Oh. So do we get to choose? I'm gonna go with, with this. Yeah, 1.5 million. I'm not gonna be purchasing it though. Sir, I don't, I have $340,000. I'm just gonna head out. I, I'm not even remotely close to this level of wealth. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're like a couple weeks away. I'll see you in episode 30, brother. Autopolis, Fuji International Speedway, the Tokyo Expressway. Definitely want to run on the Expressway. So we're going to be running this. We want uh, 550 Japanese road cars. We do have a few here, but I'm I'm thinking we probably want to buy something. Got a Sylvia Spec R Aero here. We could just straight up buy an R32. I'm tempted. Should we... Is this thing gonna be, is it, is it gonna count? I kinda, I'm, I gotta go white, dude. I, I gotta have my own, my own personal GTR in here. 94, 770. All right, we'll take it. I'm imagining we're probably gonna end up unlocking this thing too, but it's okay. I'm wondering if this is gonna be, is this too new? Is there like a, a time limit on it? Or is it considered like a supercar instead of a road car like they want? See how we're looking here. We're legal, baby. All right, we just needed a road car from Japan. So that, that works for me. I do want to come in here to GT Auto and we, of course, are going to put a wide body on this bad boy. Look at this. Nice little preview there. Let's, let's do it. I'm going to install it. $25,000. <laughs> They're pulling the car. I wasn't sure what was going on there, but that, okay, that's pretty good. I like that. Dude, she is beautiful. Now, should we do anything? How do we get into, like, the real customization? I, I kind of, if we're going to customize anything, this would be the one. So, we could change up the wheels, the paint colors, custom parts. Ooh. We can put some six splitters on this thing. I'm going to go type A splitter. Get the matching side skirts. Get the diffuser in the back. I like the, the ducktail on there. I like the stock wing. That's not bad either. I might go with the type A wing. So we're putting a type A wide body kit on this bad boy. You can debadge it on the front grill. Cost you $1,500 to take a badge off. Come on. Could put hood pins on there. 150 bucks. I kind of like the look. Just add a, a little style, a little steeze to it. Got a tow hook there. We can add a tow hook to the back as well. Roll cage. Do we want a roll cage in there? So many different types of wheels, dude. I don't even know where to begin. I mean, lots of cool options. I feel like the stock rims are not bad. You have no idea how bad I just want to spend a hundred grand and put some NOS in this bad boy. I want to so... It's unnecessary, but like... I'm going to save my money. I want to be able to buy cool cars going forward, and we really can't earn money very quickly. We, we got to stick with what we got. All right, let's 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 head to a race. A nighttime race in the GTR, baby. Oh, man. Looks like we're going around the highways and even maybe the, the docks and stuff. This, this is going to be fun. Woo! Dude. I still can't believe I have this thing in my garage, man. I'm, I'm so lucky. I'm so fortunate. Thank you, guys. Every time I see this car in a video game, I get excited about it. And it's like, bro, just, just go drive it in real life. 
I need to need to do something to it. I love the wide body kit. It it, uh, it just looks so much more aggressive. Go around this guy here. Now I, I'm gonna be honest. I, I feel like with the speeds that this thing can achieve, what are we doing here? We've got like a oh a very sharp quarter. Ooh, there's an R34 up there. What's up, little bro? What up, little bro? Very very tight turning situation here. Oh, and then we loop back on ourselves? What is happening? Trying to get this guy around the outside. Dude, this thing is so solid. That Hellcat was like, I was kind of struggling a little bit. I, to be honest, I don't, I don't know why I spun out on the, the last part of that race. Woo. I can feel all the bumps in the paint on the street. It's like rumbling inside my thing here. But yeah, like I'm, I'm dri- uh, okay. I was gonna say I'm driving way faster here and I feel way, way, way more in control than of that Hellcat. Catching up to the RX-7 here. Ooh, came in a little hot there, Trev. It's gonna give us a, a launch pad though. Let's get it. That zero to 60 is nothing to be messed with. Let's go. First time on this, this course. So obviously trying to be Fairly smart and reserved. Woo! Bro, she just, she gives you so much. She's always got more in the tank. The all-wheel drive, you just like, you, it's, it's such an easy car to drive. It's not a comfortable car necessarily. I mean, it's not bad. It's not fun to drive at low speeds. When you're out getting her up like this, not that I would ever drive anything like this. <clears throat> but, um, like when you're just rolling around town and in traffic and stuff, it's a little bit clunky. Like you can you can tell she. It's not like a luxury car, you know what I mean? You aren't a Mercedes or something. You can tell she wants to go. She doesn't want to sit there. There's a lot of clunking and banging and all kinds of weird stuff happening. Dude, this is just I'm I'm so happy right now. I am so in my element. Alright. Let's get these brakes to work here. Around this way, take her wide, take her wide, set up for the acceleration. This is kind of a fun corner. It's like all one big corner. Gonna cut the corner a bit. Try to catch first, baby. Come on. Oh, we got three laps. We're gonna catch first, no problem. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna try not to run into these guys. That's mainly what I'm gonna do. Dude, I can't believe how you can like these are like rumble strips right there. Those are like Kind of like speed rumbles to get you to slow down coming around that corner and I can the, the wheel is like shaking as we go through those. I don't know why you slowed down like that. What are you doing? Are you trying to get us killed? Woo! Okay. Well, that's gonna be quite a bit of front end damage, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know if we've got some damage up front or what, but she seems, she feels a, a little, a little less happy now. Um, it's, it's okay though. We're, we're going to be fine. We're going to, we're going to bring her home in one piece. Woo! Second place is, is catchable. I think first is still catchable too. We're just going to have to be, have to be smart about this. That was, that was not a... A great wreck, but we're gonna be able to work. Oh yeah, she doesn't want to break now. She's getting when I stomp on the brake before it used to be kind of like a a teamwork. All four brakes are breaking. I, maybe our front brakes are out or something. I don't know. Maybe the arrow's doing something weird. She's a lot less stable, but we're we're gonna work it out. Come on, baby. Let's get it. Not much time. We we made it all the way around. Ooh, I'm nervous to break. Just, just go light on the brakes. Yep, yep. She's getting a little squirrely again. Not a lot of time left here. Pretty much made it back around to where he stomped on the brakes before. I just don't know why we were stomping on the brakes going through here. This is such an easy corner to make. It's such a, I mean, you know, maybe around this corner. Forgot. I can't, I can't break it full speed. It, it really doesn't like it. Maybe that corner, but like the first corner we were going through, that just didn't, didn't make any sense. 
It's going to come around this corner, and we are going to be in the home stretch. Got the hood cam here. This is kind of cool. Haven't really used this much. Ooh, we put in our best sector right there, even with a broken car. We're going to come around through the downtown area. And I believe that's going to be a win, baby. Oh, my goodness. That, that was epic. I'm really excited to use this thing more. I can't wait to see what comes next. We are officially... Oh, yeah, she was toe up. We are officially in the cool cars, guys. This is awesome. Hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. Let me know what we should use next. Obviously, we got to keep unlocking these Japanese cars, but uh, I, I might do a second GTR episode. I don't know. We'll see. Um, I want to use it a bit more. We'll, we'll see what we can get into. Nice win.